very different from my original plan set that I had. So I am here in the McCallum Amphitheater here in Palm Springs, and guess what? We are here at Prada and they didn't let us record around the store. We're now to Jimmy Shoe to buy shoes. Maybe not. We'll see. I know that some big YouTubers are working on that and they're thinking that they're going to change the platform. Criticizing you instead of supporting you. Don't get me wrong, they're going to criticize you anyway, anywhere. <laughs> Good morning everyone, happy Saturday. Today I have a vlog and I'm gonna take you to Palm Springs with us. Today we have the Piano Guys concert and it's going to be so fun. Yeah. Despite that it's super cold. Yes, it is like 55 degrees Fahrenheit here in San Diego and Palm Springs is a desert. So we are expecting that it's going to be even cooler there and that's ruining my plans because if you watch my last vlog you know that i bought this michael kors dress that i am obsessed with i don't think that i'm going to be able to wear it because i'm going to be cold and there is nothing more yeah uncomfortable than being cold i don't like to be cold i don't like to be suffering i want to be warm i want to be comfortable <laughs> So I don't think that I'm gonna be wearing that dress. I'm gonna take it with me. I'm gonna take it with me. However, I'm just going to put some trousers and a sweater and a coat and boots, of course, because I want to be warm. And then once that we go there, we decide if it's a sunny day, I uh, decide if I wear the dress or not. The concert starts at 2 p.m. So it's pretty early in the afternoon, right? So if it's sunny, I think I'm, I'm going to be able to wear the dress. If it's sunny but it's cold, I'm just going to keep my trousers on and that's it. What's up, Muffy? <laughs> so this is today's makeup. Very, you know, subtle. I think the drama here is the lip liner. I'm using this lip liner by MAC. I think it's the Oak. The Oak shade it's a lip liner what is it let me show you actually did i use oak yes yeah, this is the oak oak lip liner by mac let me show you the shade it's very like brownish i don't know if you can see it my camera okay here you go Come on. you can see it in my lips so i'm not using well at this moment because I don't know I got sick of Whirl I have been using Whirl for years and I decided you know what Whirl is a little bit more like burgundy and right now I am more on the brownish pinkish colors so yes yeah, so I was taking a look on the Mac I stopped by Macy's and they have a Mac inside of their store and and I was trying all the lip liners that they have over there and I discovered this oak and then there is another one that I bought the stripe down something like that that's a really good one as well so this is today's makeup I'm gonna go ahead and change because it is almost 10 a.m. and Muffy wants that we open the door for her in fact let me take you because do you want that I open the door for you Oh, okay. Hurry up. Here she is. Okay, I'm gonna change. This is what I decided to wear today to the Piano Guys concert because I want to be warm. <laughs> I'm wearing this neat dress from Club Monaco that I'm obsessed with it. And then I have the gray color as well. So I was like, should I wear the smoke gray or should I wear the ivory? Well, it's more like white off a type of color and I decided to go with this color and then I'm pairing this dress with my boots from Prada that I bought pre-love and then underneath I have these leggings that are very trendy right now because as you can see they look like skin but in reality they have fleece so they're pretty warm and then on top of that I am wearing a socks yes <laughs> nobody can see my socks so this is today's outfit and very different from my original plan set that I had to wear to the piano guys, but that's it. 
that's what we have and then I'm going to be wearing this coat that is very fluffy Muffin loves it and I love it as well because I want to be warm <laughs> and that's it this one is from Zara I bought it like two years ago and it's really really nice in fact I have a photo that I post on my blog by the way if you don't know I am the owner of the Allure Edition blog so I'm just going to link the description box description I'm just going to link the website a link in the description box below is that correct I'm just going to link the blog website <laughs> in the description box below for you to take a look on my blog because I'm putting a lot of effort and I am posting at least one blog every week every Friday and once in a while actually I'm posting twice per week right now but <laughs> I don't want to commit yet at least you're gonna see a new blog every Friday okay all right so this is today's outfit this is the concerts uh, outfit uh, in spa <laughs> when it's cold when it's like 50 degrees Fahrenheit and you live in California and for you 50 degrees is a cold that's me <laughs> all right guys so I'm ready I already pack I have another two coats here because we're gonna be taking photos as well I have my Birkin 30 my Birkin 35 my Kelly inside of my Birkin cameras my coat and my suitcase is already downstairs because I do have my pajamas and other things that I'm going to be sharing. Well, I'm not going to be sharing my pajamas, but you know what I mean. Today's fry wins. I'm going to be wearing this Chloe. This is a rose tangerine and it smells so delicious. And that's what I'm going to be using today. This is the final outfit with the coat because I was like, should I wear this coat or should I wear the beige color? This one is one from H&M, but you know what? I just made the executive decision and I'm going to be wearing this one. I think it matches my my bag and it has the same vibes as like, you know, brownish situation. I have so many colors here. How many colors I have? Like one, two, three four mm, the rule is max three right i think my bag and the coat match <laughs> it doesn't matter this is what i'm gonna be wearing dude carter and i played tennis for the first time in a long time the other day you tell me that and it was fun so fun <laughs> we are here okay guys so i am here in the mccallum amphitheater here in palm springs and guess what they didn't let us get in because they're asking for proof of vaccination of you know what right so i am vaccinated my husband is not vaccinated so they're not going to let us in so <laughs> the concert that i was waiting for almost a month i'm not going to be able to enjoy because i don't have proof of vaccination okay so they gave me they gave me a refund so that's a good thing they gave me a refund for my tickets so now my husband and I are here in Palm Springs, so we need to rethink what we're gonna be doing tonight. The good news is that we have reservations on a nice restaurant, and yeah, I'm a little bit mad, but these are the rules that this amphitheater has, so no piano guys for us <laughs> because we don't have proof of vaccination. I'm mad a little bit. But you know what, that's okay. We're just going to rethink and figure out what else we're gonna be doing today. <laughs> because we're not gonna go to the piano, guys, uh, today. Oh gosh. Okay, so we just arrived here. So we're just checking the hotel. Where are you going? <laughs> you can do your thing. 
and what is the name of the hotel? The Colony. I don't know. I'm just gonna put it here. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't remember. So husband just left. He doesn't want to be in camera. Anyway, so I just want to show you the room because it's so so cute, and the hotel seems to be cute because I rented last minute. So I did that. I did a good job, I guess. Yeah. So hold on. Look at this. It has our names here. How adorable is that? Okay, let me just give you a proper tour. Let me give you a proper tour of the room. Look at this. First of all, the details, right? It has my name and my husband's name. The name of the hotel is the Colony Palms Hotel and Bungalows. Here you go. That's super cute. Okay, let me show you. And we need a little bit more light here, so bear with me, okay? This is the bed which is pretty nice. I love the colors. It has this green olive and beige colors. Okay. And then we have a fireplace. Wow. How cute is this? For sure, we're gonna, we're gonna hit the fireplace. <laughs> then we have a bar here with a goodies, probably, which is going to take a look and uh, consume some of these goodies. We have this Palm Springs Life Capri Dolce Vita. I need to check these books out. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, we have chocolates, pistachios. I don't know what else. What is this? Oh, this is the cafe station and tea station. And we have a fridge. That's good. And then what is this? Oh, nothing. Okay. <laughs> All right, so that's that. Let's keep exploring. Ooh, I like the clock. Very retro. And then here we have the closet. What do we have here? Ooh, we have robes. And then closet. This is cute. With the iron. Okay, the robes. Those are cute. Okay, what else? Look at this, guys. Let's go to the bathroom. How cute is this? The bathtub is adorable with the golden faucet. I think they're gonna take a bath. Yes, and everything is so cute. Golden hardware, so, so cute. So, husband and I decided to hit the outlets. The outlets are pretty close. So, since we have nothing to do, <laughs> We're not gonna let the Piano Guys concert let us down. Life continues, rules are rules, and we need to follow them. Next time, I need to pay attention on those details. And that's okay. We learn, move on, and we are going to enjoy the rest of our weekend. Because it's pretty weird when I hang out with my husband, just the two of us. So, we're gonna take advantage of that, and we're gonna have fun. Zero. So it has this embroidery 
this pleat design. You know what? This is polyester. This is definitely polyester. This one is size zero, $249. We didn't buy anything. We couldn't find the sweater. Okay, next one. I think that we should go. We have Prada here. So we can take a look. Let's take a look at Prada. Oh, that's the logo. Okay, let's go to Prada. Oops, sorry. Go ahead. Thank you. I'm sorry. We are here at Prada and they didn't let us record around the store. However, I'm gonna be trying this dress. It's a white dress, lace design. It's a very like bridal type of thing. And it has these beautiful buttons. They have like bling bling situation. This one is size 36, so I don't know if this is going to fit me, but this is discounted from 2500 to 1355 dollars I need glasses. It's beautiful. I'm going to try it on. And then we have this black with green and purple dress. It has these two front pockets. This one is size 38, so most likely this is going to fit. The regular price is $1,730 and it's on sale for $155. It's really cute. And then we have a black dress. You know that I'm a sucker for black dresses. This one has this golden bottom here. Very simple. Yeah, this is size 40. And the regular price is $1,320 and it's on sale for $910. Husband is here. Hi, your glory. Husband is here and he's going to decide which one is the best one. Okay? Sounds good. <laughs> okay, this is not a Prada dress. This is a Miu Miu dress. And we have a little bit of a technical difficulties because the lining situation and yeah, husband help. But it fits. This one is size 36 and this is how it fits. Super cute. It has, this is lace or embroidery. What is this? It's embroidery, right? And it has these details here, uh, the color. What do you think, husband? It's cute. It's cute. I need shapewear, because I'm showing my, my burger. But it's cute. We like the length, I like the length. Okay, rate it from one to 10. What is your rated? Rated? Rating. Eight and a half. Eight and a half. Okay. Depends on what you're doing, but that's cute, yeah. That's pretty high. Okay, next. This is the other dress. It fits better than the other one, for sure. This one is size 36. No, 38. Ooh, it has pockets. I like this one. But it depends on the occasion, right, husband? Okay, what do you think about this dress? It's not exactly my vibe, but... It's not exactly your vibe? No. Because? It's great on you, babe. What is your rating for this one? One to Five. ten. Five. Okay. All right. Next one. Last dress. This one is the size forty. I'm looking for the pockets. There is no pockets. Um. Yeah. I'm showing my bra here. It has this detail here, the golden bottom here, and mm, uh, cleavage. It's okay. It's conservative. It's uh, usually what I choose a black color dress. What do you think about this one, husband? It's interesting. What is your rating for this dress? Eight. Eight. Seven. Seven. Somewhere there. Okay. Well, the winner then is the white one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but if it's a little bit tight, a little bit tight, no, too much. We're gonna go to San Lorenz. There's always a queue. Queue is not that bad right now. So we're gonna go and do it. First thing that I saw at the store was this basket bag and it had 50% off. Then I saw this cutie that it was 50% off as well. This is adorable. I like it because it doesn't have the logo on your face. And it has this corner color. The mini version here, which is 
adorable. Look at that. This is the daughter and this is the mom. So, so cute. now to Michael Kors just to take a pic I know it's pretty loud here but what do we have here we have this pink dress it's cute with this pink bag and this cutie pink bag as well and then we have a navy blue dress with this cutie that's so cute right and then we have some sandals there all right we're gonna go inside Good morning! Happy Sunday! 
We are very early looking for a coffee place because husband needs coffee and I need tea. So we're looking for a place. The restaurant from the hotel told us that open at 8 and it's 7 a.m. So that's the urgency for coffee and tea. It's pretty cold. He's wearing shorts. <laughs> flip-flops <laughs> and flip-flops and wearing pants sneakers a coat day night no day night something like that I saw that last night and I thought it was like my, my eyes playing a trick on me we found a place the name of the place is coffee with a K and apparently there is a change because I have seen a lot of this coffee. It's like the Starbucks of Palm Springs. Here. Yeah. Yummy, the pastries. Oh, I'm definitely getting the double chocolate chocolate, double chocolate chocolate chip, okay. Chocolate is twice. We have gluten-free. White chocolate and raisin scone. Wow. They have good stuff here. Ooh, the banana walnut muffin also looks really yummy. I'm thinking to grab one of these strawberry and pineapple yogurt. They have blackberry also. So I think I'm gonna grab the strawberry pineapple. husband is going back to life with his coffee. I got the strawberry pineapple, what is this, yogurt? And then the chocolate chocolate muffin. Oh, it's upside down. And then I ordered a smoothie, a strawberry smoothie. That's a big muffin. I just want the top part. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's the most delicious part, right? You want some? No. no? We are back and actually we arrived maybe three hours ago. Mm -hmm. I have been doing laundry and unpacking. Yes, because one of the things that I am bad at it is unpacking. I just leave my suitcase there and I pretend that it's not there. <laughs> and it's full clothes, dirty clothes and clean clothes, you know that situation. And then the week comes and then I try to ignore the suitcase, the trying to disappear with my <laughs> with my my power, my mind powers and nothing, right? So that's the first thing that I did. And I'm still unpacking. And it was just one day. <laughs> we took some pictures. That's a good a good thing. We took some pictures for my blog because I need pictures for my blog articles, which is pretty nice. Remember to stop by theallurization.com. I'm posting a blog every week. If I can post more, I will post more. If not, every Friday I'm posting a new blog. It can be fashion, it can be beauty, it can be wellness, it can be whatever, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> whatever it occurs to me but I'm enjoying that so take a look on that because I'm putting a lot of effort and, and leave a comment on theallureedition.com I will appreciate if I see you there because oh yes I'm very happy when I see your comments on my blog and my YouTube as well yeah I really appreciate that really appreciate your support by the way I'm downloading the videos, the content of, um, for this blog, and I just discovered that my camera, the lens of my camera was dirty. Did you spot the dirty, blurry little thing on the middle of the screen? If you did, I apologize for that because for me it's very obvious because I know exactly what I'm looking at. If you didn't spot it, well, you know what, probably you need to wash it again. <laughs> and see if you can spot the fingerprint. I'm pretty sure there was a fingerprint on the middle of the lens. Yes, in fact, I don't know if I'm gonna put it here and just let you know what it is, it's in the middle. 
it's in the middle it's pretty bad so hopefully you couldn't see it i hope that you couldn't see it if you saw it i apologize for that but you know what that was the content and yeah i'm just gonna leave it like that <laughs> i just cleaned my lens so hopefully it's better otherwise i will be very concerned i will think that is my camera i have another camera that husband had it and i was like do you have my camera he was using it to record cutter on for soccer mm -hmm. so he said that he doesn't need it anymore he's using his phone so he has another camera this is my first g7x camera super super good and i gave it to him now he doesn't need it anymore so he gave me my camera back which is pretty amazing so i have a backup which is pretty awesome because when i'm downloading the videos of photos from this camera i can be using this one to continue blogging or continue doing my thing which is amazing and it's very very uh efficient and very productive because the thing here is to keep producing content for you keep producing yeah good content for you so i can post it immediately and the more vlogs and the more content the more moments i record the more i add them to the videos of youtube in this case i'm just putting my efforts on my blog because it's an extension well actually youtube and instagram are an extension of my blogs so take a look on my blog my blog is thealureedition.com it's going to be here and in the description box below and i'm just going to add some blog articles for you take a look leave me a comment give me some love <laughs> on my blog because i'm very very proud of my blog plus i love doing it i love writing i love yeah so to the point that i'm thinking that i'm going to hire somebody to help me with my blog so if you want to work with me that would be awesome i will be posting at the, end the opening on my instagram and i will let you know i'm pretty sure that i'm gonna need help guys and it's going to be half time i guess and well payment and everything according to law and it's going to be a big help for my blog so i'm thinking that i'm just going to hire one or two persons to help me with my blog to help me with the photos to load photos to write articles to help me with the editing and all that kind of stuff so if you're interested please let me know i will let you know formally when i am i am recording but yes i'm going to need some help because i have big big goals for this 2023 for for my blog and that's pretty awesome yes that's pretty awesome but the whole point here is to make my blog thealuredition.com very strong and then my youtube and my instagram they are like an extension of my blog but you know that you can always go to my blog to get the main content and from there we go to my youtube to my instagram and my pinterest by the way i'm on pinterest as well mm -hmm. so follow me on my pinterest as well because yeah i have three social medias youtube instagram and pinterest mm -hmm. i don't like tiktok and i do have an account on tiktok however i don't like the app i i think that is so time consuming and the quality of the content is not top <laughs> i know that some big youtubers are working on that and they're thinking that they're going to change the platform the platform is a platform and you can tell me that is good or bad i'm not here for the followers okay i'm here to promote my blog and if it's going to be on i don't know i don't want to put the words but for me tiktok is not very classy it's not very yeah what is the point to have followers if they're not going to be following you they're not going to be loyal they're just going to be criticizing you instead of supporting you don't get me wrong 
they're going to criticize you anyway anywhere <laughs> yes but i think tiktok is not it's not a classy platform plus i don't want to do that to you because it's such a waste of time oh my god oh my god once that you get in the app it's just like scrolling 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 and then by the time that you realize two hours pass it by and, and it's so unproductive so i am not 100 percent with with tiktok so i'm not the only tiktok this is what i'm thinking right now i don't know if in the future i'm gonna be using the platform as you know i have an account on you on youtube on tiktok but i started posting and at the same time that i was posting i was consuming a lot of trash content and i was absorbing and my time was absorbing on nothing so i was like you know what that's it i'm thinking to close my account on that app on the tiktok yes i do have it but i don't like it i don't use it i think that is such a waste of time and i don't want to drag you over there okay because it's not a fun app it's fun it's very entertaining but it's so like it's, it's going to drain you there and yeah instagram on the other hand yes it's very consuming as well but at least the type of content is more um, how do i say classy in a way okay so yeah the type of content there is more curated more thoughtful more high quality okay so that's what i think please let me know what you think and the on the comment section do you like tiktok if you like tiktok i respect that <laughs> it doesn't mean that i need to like it right we can agree to disagree very polite i do like instagram i use instagram uh that's why i promote my content on instagram i do like youtube in fact we don't have cable my kids do not watch cable do not watch tv they watch youtube yes so i use youtube and then i love pinterest that's why i use pinterest i don't like tiktok yes i do have an account on tiktok however i don't maintain my account and i think that i'm gonna close it mm -hmm. all right guys so i'm just going to let you go thank you so much for listening to me for this uh you know i'm rambling here <laughs> thank you so much as always thank you so much for watching and if you have more time and if you want to continue watching more of my videos you can click here right here and guess what i'll see you there bye bye guys see you on my next one